Hello. In this video we will show you how to do your first sale in the Robotil Retail Module. You can follow the instructions on the Robotil website to download and install Robotil. When you open Robotil for the first time, the database setup wizard will install SQL Server for you. Once the setup has completed, there will be three Robotil icons on your desktop. Open Robotil Back Office. If you are logging in for the first time, you can use the default username, admin, and the default password, password. The interactive interface will indicate that we have no products and that we need to create a product. Click on products and stock, and then on products. Our product list will be empty as we have no products yet. Click on new to create a new product. Enter a product description. Enter a stock code. The stock code can simply be a shorter version of the description that is still unique. You can either enter a stock code or a barcode number, or both. Click on create this product, to create the product. Once the product has been created, more options for this product will become available. For this demonstration we will only select the product price. Select product prices. You can simply enter the product price if you want, but as we want the system to keep track of our profit, we will enter the cost and the price. As you change values in the pricing, other values will automatically be calculated. You will notice that there is no update or save button. In Robotil back office, once an item has been created, any changes you make will automatically be saved. We now use the navigation bar to go back to products. Our new product has been created. We can add more products if we want, but we will just use our one product for this demonstration. We again use our navigation bar to go back to our home screen. Let's do our first sale. On your desktop, double click on Robotil Retail. You will be asked if you want to upgrade to the full edition. As we are just going to use the free edition, we select no. You can log in with the default user, using the default pin of 12345. We can scan items using a barcode scanner. We can also use a keyboard to type codes or descriptions. If your till does not have a keyboard, you can use the keypad to type a code. As the code is alphanumeric, we can use the on-screen keyboard. You can type the stock code, barcode number, or description of the product. If only part of the description is typed, a list of items matching that description will be displayed. The item will be added to the sale. We can add more items. We could also search for items if we don't know the code or the correct description. To finish the sale, click on Pay. Multiple payment methods can be used per sale. We could also add more payment options in Robotil back office if needed. The electronic cash drawer, if you are using one, will open. The change will be displayed and the receipt will print. There are obviously a lot more you can do in the retail module. We will be uploading more training videos on more advanced topics. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell button so that you will be notified when new videos are available. Thank you for watching this video.